So if you guys remember a couple of months back, CJ and Royalty were going at it tough for custody of the twins. And around this time, CJ pulled up to one of the meetups with a weapon, allegedly. Now, one of Royalty's supporters is exposing some messages between herself and Royalty during that time. And I will say that this is all alleged because I cannot confirm if Royalty actually sent these messages so let's start with the message that was sent from one of royalty's supporters at the time she states he has mental issues talking about cj royalty allegedly responds with yes he does and then the girl states so let me call the pd right now and get started on my end royalty responds with thanks boo you welcome sis and she asks royalty do he have the kids now royalty allegedly responds with no, I have them. Then the girl asks, okay, what's the date he pulled out the G-U-N? Royalty allegedly responds with June 15th. So then they go back and forth a little bit. Royalty stating, I already have more than enough stuff to win. I just need someone aggressive enough to fight his lawyer because she is very aggressive. The girl responds with, okay, I got you. Tomorrow I will call the lawyer. Now this time Royalty was looking for another lawyer. Remember she fired one of her lawyers and she had to get another one. So you guys can pause and read the full interview interaction but again it was a lot of back and forth about this girl telling royalty to get an emergency court order so then they allegedly started talking about this whole cps thing the girl states cps needs to also take the kids away from him tomorrow i'll call the lawyer royalty states they came to both of our houses the girl responds with did cps give you temporary custody because they were supposed to it will also help in your case Royalty states, no, they came to CJ's house first and he lied to them. They got the real story from us, but the lady said she was going to make a police report about it. I want someone to call them on him so he can take a drug test too. And it looks like the girl stated, girl, let me do everything if you give me the okay. Hey, so then the girl states CPS needs to evaluate CJ for mental health. Royalty responds on another date that I asked for that. She states CPS just came to my house again and I have to do another drug test. Send them over there and say nobody is watching them by the pool because they're getting high. The girl responds with I already did. She said she was going to contact her supervisor ASAP. Royalty says, okay, thanks. Again, you guys can pause and and read the rest of this alleged interaction between royalty and her former supporter now again i can't confirm if these are actually from royalty's real account but the girl did post a screen recording of the whole text message thread and then clicked on the page to show that hey this is really royalty's page but i don't know you guys leave your opinions on that down in the comment section below what i'm not sure of is why she's putting out all of these messages now from what i heard she was upset because royalty stopped responding to her after she asked her to post some sort of fundraiser that she was doing again i cannot confirm that but what i can state is this is what was actually put out and all of this again is alleged so you guys leave your opinions on that down in the comment section below but now let's move on to this next topic with ray and deja now if you guys didn't know they were reportedly back together again they were posting videos together they were going out to eat going on dates all types of things well it seems like in one of those videos that was posted by deja when they were on a date she forgot to edit out a part where her phone screen was showing and people noticed that her ex was actually calling her phone as you can see it says lyric stupid a and it looks like it's a facetime call so ray goes on to twitter and she states if you gonna lie at least move p in words get caught on all dummy ish and just be lying ish is crazy then she goes on to tweet i'll never show love again 
Dumb being a dumb B word. Someone responds with, damn, what Deja do? They responds with, just be lying and the truth ain't in her. So then Deja comes back and responds with, lying about what exactly? While people being investigating gadgets, it says Instagram audio. Yes, she called me on Instagram to get the rest of her belongings out of my house. Oh, she still doesn't have my number to this day. You see me in her DMs actually right after. Now I do know people can call you from Facebook and Instagram, but it seems like she has a special name saved for her. So I don't know if that pops up the same way if they're calling you from Instagram. But anyways, Deja also went on to say, Ray does everything in her power to make herself look good. So good and innocent as if we don't handle it off the media. You truly don't want MFS to know exactly what went down that night. Leave Twitter alone today. Thanks. So Deja is stating, look, if you keep on going, I'm about to expose everything. So you guys leave your opinions on this situation down below, as well as what you guys think about the whole situation with royalty and her family former supporter. Now she also posted her interactions with one of Royalty's other support pages, BSC TV, as well as from Royalty's brother Van. As you can see here, she wrote to BSC TV the whole time I'm talking to a DHS worker and gave the B word the worker name. Come to find out it's her caseworker. She never even told me. She played me the whole time. So then BSC TV responds with, damn gang, I'ma hit her up for you. The girl responds with, I'm cool on shawty. She did me dirty. Then he responds with saying she had you call her CPS worker. The girl responds with bro. Yep. So I'm not exactly sure what went on there. Again, this is all from what I'm hearing happen and why they fell out and why she's deciding to expose these texts and all this between herself and royalty and even bring royalty's brother and other support pages there not sure how much more she has but she's claiming to have more that she will be exposing so as always i will keep you guys updated on everything you guys leave your opinions down in the comment section below